just another mistletoe that I can't stand cause I'm on my own by the fireside. I'm so cold inside cause Christmas ain't the same here without you, baby. It's the morning, but it doesn't look like it. What is that one? So Jarvis, I turned the camera on because Jarvis wants me to open his gift well, already. I want, to get, I want to get it over with so I can go, get about, it over my, with. So I can go about my day. <gasps> Is that the one that was over the intercom? Yeah. It was. All right. Okay, guys, we're starting today off fast. All righty. Ready, Boo? We're ready. So let's recap for a moment here. Jarvis said he had a little trouble with one of the items, correct? You have to, you can't, nobody can see you nodding. So you have correct. To, okay. <laughs> and you said that the five below employees had to make an announcement over the intercom, mm -hmm. correct? You can't nod. Either. Correct. Okay. And you're giving it to me now, correct? Uh -huh. Yep. And you're going to tell us the story. Oh, there's another big of a story. I should Correct. <laughs> Correct. <laughs> Wait. You know I hate this movie. <laughs> Least favorite movie of all time. What happened with this? <laughs> what was the problem with it? Well, it or did they immediately want to take you into custody oh, wait, oh, what was for the buying this? at the register? Yeah. Oh well, it wouldn't scan. So, so there's a bunch of people in line, <laughs> and the lady looks to her left. She's talking to the other cashier. She's like, "This this Boss Baby movie won't scan. Do you know how much this Boss Baby movie costs?" I don't think I've ever heard somebody say boss baby more in their life. Oh my god, I'm and, then, and then she got on the intercom, she's like, can somebody check the price on the boss baby movie? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I literally, we watched this movie. Why did we watch this movie that one day? I can't tell you how much this baby pisses me the f*** off. Did we see it somewhere or do we just watch it? Did we see it in, movie, in theater? I thought we saw it in theaters. Did we we see might it have. I think we saw it at IPIC at the Arboretum. And, it, and this baby was walking around like it was the king of the castle, dude. Like, literally walking around like Wolf of Wall Street. Yeah, it was, it was IPIC. I was so furious watching this movie. This baby has attitude. Oh my god, this is the worst movie ever. Did we even finish it? I'm notorious for walking out of movie theaters if I don't like the movie. Because we walked out of, and, and I usually walk out when I'm with you, because I refuse it's to watch it. It's only when I pick the movie, though. If you pick the movie, I always walk out. <laughs> no, we, I stage a walkout, because, well, what happened when we saw Jurassic World, or whatever the heck it was? Jurassic World. We had to leave, because I couldn't take it any longer. Tell them why you couldn't take it any longer, because it wasn't anything to do with the plot. It didn't have anything to do with the acting. It actually had it nothing had... to do with the movie inherently. Yes, it did. No, it didn't. It was the choices made. It was what they were showing on the screen. It was despicable. They they, they put, and I don't even remember the circumstances, because I blocked it out. They had to feed a T-Rex. They had to feed it one of the, one of the yeah, they had to feed one of the dinosaurs. A T-Rex. With, with the most cutest goat I ever saw. A CGI goat. A, a goat is still a goat, even if it's a CGI goat. And I couldn't take it anymore. It had it just sitting there helpless, and I'm not gonna stand for that. It's, a CGI it's sick. goat fed to a CGI dinosaur. Yes, it's sick. Whoever the producer was, or their director, or whatever, whoever made that choice is actually a sadist. Okay, so today Jarvis got me the world's worst movie. There's another great day of gifts. Do you want to open one more? Stop! I, we, I can't open all your gifts today. Do you want to open one more or not? Yeah, I do. But what are you going to do? We're going to run out of your gifts. I guess you're just going to be out of gifts. It's going to be a very sad Christmas for you. Oh. And you got a deal on this. Did you know this was only $325? I don't, I, don't even, I don't even look at the price anymore. 
Oh my. Oh, okay. <laughs> and five below. Well, it's because every other trivia game we were playing, it's been from the freaking 20s. Outdated. It's, yeah, it's Trivial Pursuit and it's like yeah. from 1884. Right. Wait. It's from 1776. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, okay. This is good. I didn't even show. Trivia from 80s, 90s, 2000s, and 2010. Okay, I really want to do the 2000s because that's. I'm like obsessed with the 2000s right now. Buying iDogs, buying My Little Ponies off eBay. Okay, are you ready? Yeah. Let's do. Let's let's do a flash around. Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm so ready for this. What? What? In what year was the first iPod released? 2000, 2005, 2003, 2001. 2001. You're right. Yeah. See, I don't get these wrong. All right, we'll see this one then. What star did Madonna kiss at the 2003 VMAs? A. Britney Spears. B. Drake. C. Avril Lavigne. D. Kelly Clarkson. Kelly Clarkson. Britney Spears. Who? Yeah. Wait, who kissed who? Madonna. At the 2003 VMAs. Who could that. forget the 2003 you, you VMAs? Were, you were too busy putting on your Grinch shirt and freaking parking your ass in front of RuneScape. You were, you were watching celebrities in 2001. What did AIM stand for? Oh my god, I was on this every day talking to Snowblitz. Snow Wait, that was my username! <laughs> <laughs> no! Me? Me? Who's Snowblitz? My username on AIM. <laughs> Everybody comment your username on AIM right now. Mine was Snowblitz3000. And I legit thought that that was like the coolest p Like this is f***ing awesome. <laughs> I used to talk to Smarter Child all day. It was like, Smarter Child was this robot that was like an automated like person who was always online. And that was the only person that was ever online for me. I had no other friends. It was the AI. Yeah, it was an AI thing. Okay, so what does it stand for? It was an AI that knows everything about you because you talk to What it. does it stand for? AOL is domestic. Yes. Paris Hilton and Nicole Richie started in what, uh, which oh, 2000s on, reality show? Oh, come on, that's so show? easy. What? It's the one you weren't allowed to watch. Uh, I wasn't allowed to watch anything. I wasn't uh, allowed to watch it, MTV. Uh, what was it, called? it was called, uh, it's one where they went around doing people's jobs and shit. Yeah, The Simple Life. Yeah, Simple Life. <laughs> Which social media network was founded in 2004? Uh, Facebook? Yep. Oh my god. The only one you got wrong was the Britney Spears one, which I'm actually kind of glad about. What year did the, did the Iraq War begin? You should know this because you're a boot boy. Uh, 2001? 2003. 2003? Yeah. Uh-oh. Time to go back to basic training. <laughs> no, it was definitely You're going back. What hurricane hit New Katrina. Orleans in 2005? Well, Let me finish the question. Well, something I don't know, please. What year did the iPhone debut? Uh, you already asked this. No, I didn't. Know. iPhone. It's 2006. Close, 2007. 2007. Wow, I don't remember any of the years I was even alive. Right, now the show is about to start. I'm, You're going to get going. every single one of these wrong. I am going to get them all wrong because I don't know where I was from the year 2000 to 2013. When I graduated high school, you, I don't remember any part of like I barely remember anything. I don't I don't remember where I was. I it's just snippets. Like I can't. I don't. I honestly didn't. I don't. I don't think I thought thoughts. All right, go. And with that being said, go. Who was the top selling music artist of two of the two thousands? Eminem, Usher, Britney Spears, Madonna. I already know that. Britney Spears. Eminem. That was easy. How is that easy? Because all the stuff was about Britney Spears in the 2000s. Come on, this is rigged. Wait, wait what's the, what's the kid on the Polar Express? The kid, he's like, come on, what, what do you look, what, what are you looking at? What, what, what you, do you mean? You have a major issue where everything in your life you need to somehow relate back to Polar Express, <laughs> and you need to figure it out. All right, go. Because that, go. What was the name of the first YouTube? Oh, did she get this one? What was the name of the first YouTube video posted in two thousand five? I know this one. Give me the hit. Me at me in the park. Me in New York. Me at the zoo. Me at my house. Uh, me in the park. Me at the zoo. You should look up that video. I should videos. name the title "Me at the Zoo" of this video. <laughs> you should look up "Me at the Zoo." And see no. What it is. 
Why? All right, just just next question because I'm I'm really got to get one right now. Oh, you still haven't got one right. No, I haven't. What popular brand featured a monkey as the mascot? You should get this one. I'm not oh yeah yeah limited two. No. What popular brand featured a monkey? Give me the names. You should know this. Kipling. No. Go. Lisa Frank. Paul Frank. Baby Paul Pat. Frank. Or Fubu. Paul Frank. Final answer. It's Paul Frank. I knew it. But you guessed three rocks, so it doesn't count. <laughs> Those all feature monkeys, I'm pretty sure. So actually I got three right in one. What person. actor played John Tucker in John Tucker Must Die? Oh my god, I know this. Give me the give me the names. No. <laughs> give me the names. No, you rest reference this movie so much that you need to get this without Come on, give me the names. No, I know who it know. is. No, you should know. Give me the names. In the process of elimination in your own mind. John Tucker must die. This guy has been in Hallmark movies, so I can do this. I can do this. I just need to give me the give me the options. What the hell is this? <laughs> give me the options. <laughs> well, I've never played trivia where they don't give you the options. Who wants to be a millionaire? But you gotta just narrow no. it down. <laughs> give me the options. <laughs> they don't give you the options in Jeopardy. Come on. Channing Tatum. No. Chad Michael Murray. No. Josh Duhamel. No. Jesse Metcalf. Jesse Metcalf. Thank you. Final you only, answer. You only know because the other I option. knew because he's been in Hallmark movies. I no, just watched it. Because the other option. Go. Saw. Which rock band released, released their debut album in the 2000s? Get the options? What is wrong with you? Which rock band released an album in the 2000s? What's so hard? What? Come on. Give me the options. Coldplay, Arctic Monkeys, Radiohead, Maroon 5. Coldplay. Yeah. I love Coldplay. I, I've always wanted to go to a Coldplay concert. So if anybody has tickets, you better hit me up now. Okay? Now. All right, go. Which celebrity had a line of edible beauty products? The options. Just read them You're off. You're this big makeup person. Edible beauty. I'll know when you say. Just think about what, what products did people have to buy you in the 2000s because you kept eating your makeup. <laughs> Everybody, everybody knows every great beauty guru starts off eating makeup so they can know what it's really like from within. Go! Hillary Duff, Jessica Simpson, Mandy Moore, Ashley Tisdale. It has to be Jessica Simpson. It was Jessica Simpson. I knew it. See, I am a real beauty guru. Go. Which show was not on MTV? This is going to be This is going to be tough. This is going to be impossible because my parents wouldn't let me watch MTV! <laughs> my super sweet 16. That was on MTV. Room Raiders, The Sharia Life, Sharia, 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 mm -hmm. Surreal, 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 The Surreal Life, and Punked. Surreal Life. Yeah. Sometimes I snuck a couple hours of MTV. A couple minutes before you, I got home from school, my mom you, wasn't you, home. You clicking the Go Back channel, Go Back button? Yes! I did that! <laughs> I'm me watching Next, and then I'm like, I hear the garage door go up, I go, back, back. What popular movie remake starred Lindsay Lohan and Jamie Lee Curtis? Oh my god, Freaky Friday, and that's obvious. Yeah, that's my mom's favorite movie. Really? Yeah. That is, that's a good one. Uh, what small device played short clips of popular songs? Hate clips. Yep. Where were the Olympic Games held in 2000s? Give me the options. Athens, Madrid, Sydney, Florence. This one's easy. What were you doing in kindergarten? Athens. No. What was it? Sydney. You don't remember that? Who cares? No. No, I don't remember that in kindergarten. No, I don't actually. Go. What was the must have flip phone of the 2000s? Razor. Motorola Razor. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't have one of those either. Thanks, Mom and Dad. Who was the female singer in the Black Eyed Peas? Or Black Eyes Peas? Black eyes? Is it black eyes or black eyes? Black eyed. It's black eyed, right? Black eyed, yeah. With a D. Or maybe it is black eyes, Pete. This is black eyes. Okay, well, it was Fergie. Yeah, it was Fergie. Next. What social media network was popular before Facebook? MySpace. Yeah. Wasn't allowed to have one of those either. And I would always dream of what my, my MySpace page would be, who my top eight would be. I mean... It's like I missed out. Okay, go on. This is actually traumatizing for me. What teen heartthrob was one of the first YouTube sensations? Options. 
No, just think about who you're dreaming about in the 2000s. Go. Justin Bieber. I know it. It's Jerry Fred. Jonah. It's Fred. <laughs> oh. <laughs> they're talking about annoying orange. Okay, go. Is that Fred? Justin too? Bieber or who? Justin Bieber who? Joe Jonas, Justin Timberlake, Shawn Mendes. It was Justin. Justin who? Because he was discovered on YouTube. I listed up two Justin. Justin Bieber. Oh. oh, you're on a first name basis with him? <laughs> I mean, oh, Justin? <laughs> yeah. What pop star taught you how to spell bananas? Gwen Stefani. Yeah. I'm good at these. What bracelets were shaped like animals and traded with? Ban uh, silly bands. What sensational game app came out in 2009? Flappy Bird. No. But that is one of the options. Give me, give me options. <clears throat> Flappy Bird, Angry Birds, Green Angry Bird. Birds. Yep. What popular movie starred a green ogre? Shrek. Yep. These are too easy. What brand of scooter was iconic in the 2000s? Razor. Yep. That's all of them. That gnashed up my ankles. That was all of them and I got all of them right? I didn't even miss you one? Didn't ask, I didn't ask you all of them. You guys, my PC has arrived, okay? My PC has arrived. I am freaking out. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Do I, Bowie? Like, I don't know what to do. I'm like freaking out. Cause I don't know how to set it up. I honestly don't. This thing is freaking Beautimus. You can't even see. Like which way is up? Which way is up? I think it's this I think this is way. Oh my god. You guys, what is going on? Okay, trying to be careful here. This thing is freaking massive. It ain't cheap. So, let's see. Um, these handle care, tempered glass. I probably shouldn't be doing this till it's all ready to go, but oh my god, oh my god. What is this even? I don't even know what to do. I literally don't even know what to do. Boo, what is going on with this computer, huh? it's miss fix it here so this wasn't turning on and I'm like what the fuck like I paid all this freaking money for these RGB lights and I got it working I was like no I know these are supposed to have RGB lights I know this is supposed to be like a dope case and it is but I had to take the back off and make sure like all the cables were connected and I found out that this one down here wasn't connected all the way so i had to take everything apart put it back together okay. so now it looks freaking awesome and i had to buy two things already for this pc so first thing i had to buy was a wi-fi like adapter thing because 
I am not close enough to the Ethernet. Where I don't like like the look of it, so I have to buy a Wi-Fi like adapter thingy. And then because I want to do two PCs, I had to buy a Display Port to HDMI cable. So those are both coming tomorrow, but I can still play the game today because Jarvis let me use his HDMI thing. Dude, this looks awesome. I'm so excited. This is crazy. Like, legit crazy. Okay, everyone, so I'm making dinner. I'm doing spaghetti. Um, we're celebrating Jarvis's 4.0. He got a 4.0. Yahoo! Um... Probably even more impressive than that is he took like 18 credit hours this semester, so it's pretty damn good if you ask me, since I know everyone is asking me. But um, these are some meatless meatballs. Everybody knows that watches this channel that I consider spaghetti and meatballs to be a one of the four main food groups. What are the four main food groups? Elf movie. Oh, candy, candy canes, candy corns, and syrup. So, mine's pretty close to that. I would just say, yeah, like, spaghetti, I would say mac and cheese, I would say Burger King Impossible Burger, and I would say tacos. Tacos and fajitas are in the same strain. I honestly probably could live without pizza, but I don't think I could live without mac and cheese, spaghetti, tacos, or burgers. I just couldn't. I just couldn't, okay? I couldn't. Jeez. Um, I'm just listening to Christmas music, minding my own business. So, yeah. Oh my god. I was about to end the vlog, and then I was like, wait a minute, I forgot to do my grandma's advent calendar. The other ones, I'll just, I'll do them another day, okay? We'll just push them back. But today is another day of my grandma's advent calendar. It's too cute. This is too stinking cute. So, it's cutlery, which she put inside of this, um, I'm sure this is like an ornament or something, or like a, it's just a Merry Christmas stocking. I mean, that is the cutest thing in the world, but you know what I've seen her do, actually? So, she does this, like I said, she has a lot of parties. This is a, a this is absolutely adorable. It's adorable, but... What I've seen her do is when she has parties, she'll put this on every single, like as a place setting, on every single person's, um, where they're sitting. So this would be so cute to set your table this Christmas. If you guys are doing like Christmas dinner or whatever you're doing, Christmas Eve. This is too stinking cute. I absolutely love it. I love it this little stocking boot. I did not see this at Dollar Tree. I am not getting the good stuff, but maybe I just didn't know where to look. <laughs> but this is so cute and it's got like a little bling Merry Christmas inside of it. You see that? So I, once again, I'm like not opening these because I feel like they're such good gifts to give that I honestly will be giving them away but she gave us a good idea so like if you set your table there's a lot of great things that you can do at the Dollar Tree for like table settings so she always does stuff like that she's been doing that for like literally 10 years 20, 20 years like as long as the Dollar Tree's been open practically she's been always doing Dollar Tree table settings and just fun like craft things anyway another great idea so yeah i think i'm gonna end the vlog here i feel like we had so much fun today playing trivia like i just want to play more trivia <laughs> but um and we i got my pc working hello so hopefully that stuff comes that i ordered so it finally actually works tomorrow but i'm getting there i'm so close and then i just need to like 
beautify it a little bit more and then we're gonna be cooking okay we're gonna be cooking so anyway i will see you guys tomorrow bye